So, <laughs> the biggest game of the season is upon us tomorrow. It's Rangers versus Celtic. The Old Firm Derby is back. Of course, going into this game, it's a difficult, very difficult game to call. Yes, Rangers are on, obviously, of course, the better of form, but Celtic have picked up a lot of form in recent weeks. Uh, so, going into the game, uh, of course, it's, to, to me, 50-50. It can go both ways. However, for a Celtic perspective, the thing is, we can't afford not to win. Uh, of course, if it ends a draw, fair enough. We just need to hope that Celtic continue the great form throughout the rest of the season, which is hard to ask, but it can be done. And Rangers drop more points. But this is the best chance we've got to claw back the 16-point gap uh, to minimise it to 13 with three games to spare. So in terms of the going into the game itself, Celtic need to go all out and make sure we win the game. Uh, we have got the attack force to do it. Griffiths and Edward are proving once again that as a partnership they work an absolute treat. Uh, the link up play, the setups, the first touches, the recognition and knowing where each other are, it, it works magnificent. Uh, Turnbull, of course, has to start for me personally. He's brought a new spark to the cent central midfield area of Celtic. So going forward, we're getting more opportunities to random passes over the defence from Turnbull due to his awareness. And it, it can score for long distance as well. But uh, the team itself has perked up. The only worry we've got is Julian getting injured, so Duffy possibly is going to have to step in and step up to the mark. To me, personally, he can he can step up to it. Yes, he's been a bit of a bomb scare from time to time, but he is a proven great centre-back. So maybe this game, maybe the team having all the confidence they need can spark a, a good result. Uh, players like Duffy who have lacked confidence the last month or two tops, uh, can gain that confidence going into the game, have a comfortable feeling in him in central defence because his team around him are playing more better. There's going to be less chances given away, hopefully. But uh, no, players like Sorrow, Turnbull for me personally need to start. Whether Brown starts, we don't know because of the experience and the leadership. But Brown, of course, is getting to that time now where he can't start every game. So whether Neil Lennon's rested him recently to gain him up for this game, we'll just need to wait and find out tomorrow. But to me, as long as Turnbull... Edward and Griffiths all start. I'm more than happy. I really do hope that Sorrow starts. So, uh, Sorrow, of course, has been magnificent in the last couple of weeks, scoring an absolute screamer, uh, a goal against Dundee United as well. But apart from the goal, he's been he's brought a more Kante style. He's not obviously as good as Kante. That's not what I'm saying. But he's brought that kind of flair to the team, that kind of sweeping up the ball in midfield, just winning every tackle that he goes into, every challenge and gets his back on attack when we've lost the ball, lost possession but but like I said, credit to Rangers Wales too that they are an absolute force right now, they're playing absolutely great football every player in their team, for what I've seen is playing at the top of their game however, we need to remember the Celtic fans that this Rangers team is the same team pretty much that they had last season where we can beat them we have got a strong team, and I still strongly believe that. Uh, our morale has been horrendous recently, but we have been picking up wee pieces of form in the last couple of weeks. Like the game against Dundee United, we really did spark into life. We were moving off the ball, something that we've not done a lot of, right? So that's what's causing a lot of the lack of play, the lack of style, and the lack of flair for Celtic. But no, there will be a force, and we just need to be wary. However, going into the game, my prediction for final say is going to be Celtic to Rangers nil. That's my final prediction. Guys, please hit subscribe and comment your prediction.